Hey, this is Tosh from ps3blog.net. I'm just going to do a quick walkthrough on how to get to the recovery menu or safe mode and do the rebuild database. So the first thing, turn it on but hold the power button until it turns off again. And this works on any PS3 if it's a slim fat or super slim. Okay, now this time you're going to wait for two quick beeps and then you're going to let go. Okay. Now we should see that just asking to connect via USB. And I'll explain what this is in another video, but I'm just going to do the rebuild database on this one. Sorry for the glare. Let's try that. So, basically, if you have any messages in the inbox or sent box, those will all be deleted. If you have any playlists, or I call them albums, like you can use them to organize your pictures, movies, music, etc., all those you'll have to redo. So, something to keep in mind um, and it does not take a few hours to rebuild the database I promise you I'll show you how long it takes right now So it's just saying that the database on the system store should be rebuilt. Okay. I'll just take a couple minutes to do this. So this is good to do from every couple months just to kind of rebuild everything, keep it fresh. I first did this when I was playing just a video that was on the hard drive that had trouble playing like it was stuttering and just really the sound was off. So I did this and it fixed it right away as soon as it, this process was done. Now some people have issues with trophy syncing or the games are kind of buggy, etc. I would, this would be the first thing I would try you know, you're not going to lose anything other than your playlist or inbox messages sent. So that's a good thing to do. Um, I've seen some people that have issues with this, like if it stops at this point, if it stops, if it doesn't progress, like after 10 minutes or something, you can just turn the system off and some people say that it's because your hard drive is going bad or starting to go bad so at that point I'll start backing up everything to a external hard drive and move to a new hard drive before your hard drive crashes completely but don't be afraid to do this even if it Stop so you can just turn the system off and then try it again. If you still have issues, then it's probably your hard drive, or um, that'd be my first guess. As you can see, this doesn't take a few hours, it probably takes three or four minutes. So, not bad. Okay. Well, it's just 
going to restart one more time and then that is it. Short and sweet. So that's all there is to it. You know, let, let me know if you have any questions. Um, again, this is Toss from ps3blog.net. Um, hopefully this video has been helpful to you. Um, I'll talk to you later. See ya.